I don't think he's in this room yet. Oh, I see. The puzzle wasn't solved yet. Oh yeah, we're great, and right in the, oh, God, in that little pocket. Of course, of course it worked, and it dropped in the pocket. Where else would it go? Okay, it's not, it's actually not in the pocket. Okay, never mind. Oh, frick, I'm gonna have to go back out there, and he's out there. I gotta go all the way back over here. Private collection room. <sighs> okay, east storage. Then, then down. Yeah, east storage and down. Okay. Oh, let's go. <sighs> He's in here now. Great. Do I want to... No. <sighs> okay. Oh, frick! Shit, that's the wrong way! We don't have any healing. Red herb. Perfect. Excellent. That's why I wanted to hang on to that. Uh, um, okay. Do we have any high grade? Do we want to make acid rounds though? Do we really? Gunpowder, just one gunpowder. Freaking footprints, man. Or footsteps, dude. They, oh. You know what's funny is I thought about making a spooky alert with footprints, and I was like, nah, none of these sound good. And now, now I kind of wish I had, because holy crap, that would be an easy way to get me on edge. Okay. 
Oh, I see, I see, I see, okay. Right? Maybe I can't have any... Maybe both need to go in? I guess. I did it. <laughs> yeah, now's the time to answer the phone. It's like Resident Evil 7. <laughs> Are disc two. Where is that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Sherry, all right? For now. My cell phone. Well, you bastard, if you hurt her. Stupid kid. If you just hadn't dropped that fucking thing, I could let you go. Orig originally a PlayStation game. It'll be all over soon. There has to be a way out of here. Oh, nice. There was an N64 port, from my understanding, it was pretty bad. Well, we found our way out, but how do we get through it? Okay, that's not creepy at all. Not even a little bit. Oh. Take them. I can't, okay. But only that way. Alright, so we need to find half a circle. There we go. It's only with two squares. Oh, this is the wrong one. I need a half circle with a square. This. Triangle diamond. Or triangle star. There's another circle or triangle star. Half circle square. Convenient. The N64 port was actually really good. One of the first ones to have controls other than tank controls. Oh. Interesting. I, uh, I didn't know. I didn't think the N64 was a great console. Very low frames per second on, like, literally every game. What is this?
and very weird blocky sort of visuals. There was a lot of great ga games on the N64, but like, there was a few amazing games, but then the library as a whole was really limited. We got some mega RE7 vibes here. Having to escape people instead of zombies. Yeah, like Quest 64. Sally's Diary, January 4th. Wednesdays are perfectly great days because we get snacks and ice cream. I hate the last place I was at. The teachers were all meanies. I was just, it was just study, 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 and there wasn't no ice cream. I love, love, love it here. To be fair, I grew up on the N64, and while it was the strongest console on the market at the time, in terms of power, Nintendo didn't really tell those who developed for it to fully use that power. I don't think so. I don't think so. I mean, it might have had power, but, like, developers tried to push it too much, if anything, because the frame rates were really low and the visuals were really choppy. It was really hard to play games on the N64, especially, like, GoldenEye and stuff. Even though I played the absolute hell out of GoldenEye, Zelda, Mario, stuff like that, in general, uh, it was really not a great console. Just a lot of very important games, like I said, like Zelda and Mario, made huge changes to game markets. January 10th, there was an important rule made today. Everyone must write a diary, get health checkup, and we ain't allowed outside by ourselves. But it's good we don't have to go to school. I don't want to go and get picked on for my old clothes, especially not by the guy that used to wear them. Uh, but, I mean, N64 was out when I was, like, a teenager, so I still kind of grew up with it. I remember, like, getting home from school and inviting the friends over and playing Goldeneye, like, all the time. So, it's still part of my teenage childhood stuff, uh, as well. But I preferred the SNES and PlayStation. January 16th, the Orphanage Director is coming today, so... I'm gonna wear my most favoriteest checkered blue outfit. The director is tall, the director has a mustache, the director is a policeman. Hmm, God, I wonder who he is. I wonder who the director is, guys. Did I unlock all the extra cheats on GoldenEye fairly? I, you bet your butt I did. I absolutely lived that game. The expansion pack to help? Yeah, true. Some games required it. I just imagine Chief Irons is going to come in at any time and just have to sneak around him. Let's go this way first. <clears throat> yeah, uh, facility. You're talking about facility. That was by far the hardest one was facility, beyond a shadow of a doubt. Because you did do it on very hard, and that level was just super unfair with a lot of like random spawns and stuff. Facility is a very famous map for its uh, good design, though. It's used it's used and copied all the time in other first-person shooter games. People make facility all the time. That must be the door out of here. Well. Gonna need a key. Darn it! I need the key! 
This means nothing to me because I can't read. February 5th. It's been two months since I le sent that letter to Oliver and I'll need to... And all I've gotten back is not a zip. Then again, they're all like that once they get adopted. But he's living like a king in some fancy folks home and forgotten all about us. Really thought Oliver was different. Thought he'd be my friend for less or for life. Guess I'm just a fool. And sat February 8th and sat all the little kids down and told them a story today. She said all the kids that get ad get adopted are turned into food for the buggy men. What the hell? Had the 64 DD come out here, I think that might have helped bring a breath of fresh air to the N64. The PS1 could still have won the Gen IMO, but this N64 would have definitely been able to compete more than it did. Mm, that came out pretty late in the, con in the console life, didn't it? By that time, people were moving on, I, I want to say. That's why no one hears from there ever again. Not sure where she gets her ideas from, but she's sure got the mind of writing trashy horror movies. <laughs> There's something weird going on around here, and it's not just because of Anne's stories. Don't get me wrong. I've been in worse places, and this place is funded by some big drunk drug company. But why can't we call people or go outside? Why are there so many doctors around? What's with these shots every day? It's almost like we're dot dot dot. February 14th. I'm getting adopted. Me. Most people go for younger kids, so I figured I was too old. But I can't say I'm not happy. I'm a little, I'm a, I can't say I'm a, not a little happy. Who am I kidding? I'm totally psyched. I say goodbye to this place on the 20th. I'm gonna try my best to be a good son. Someone my new mom and pop can be proud of. February 19th. Oliver came back in the middle of the night, all messed up, screaming, help me and stuff. I didn't recognize him at first. His face was all peeling and melted off. He's with the teachers and doctors now. It's just a skin thing, they said. I'll get better soon. And then we can go on adventures again together. Yeah, sure. I'm sure Oliver's just fine. Welcome back, Wismith. I missed you. Smile. This looks like the RE1 house. Oh, it's like that famous painting, the picnic thingy. Well, don't say that out loud. Oh, well, I guess I don't have any other way to go, all right? Blank's diary. If you're reading this, go call... Poe, Coise, Boogeyman's here eating everybody. Many dark Boogeyman's here. Help to coming, help me, mommy. Aw, cute kid. Oh, yep, here's the creepy part. Here's, here's how he was. in uh the previous game I'm glad they covered her up Where you going Sherry? Nowhere. I told you to stay put. You need to learn to listen. Leave me alone. Just please. Time to teach some manners. Uh. Ah! Oh! You little bitch. You're gonna pay for this. Oh, you little shit. You hear? Got him. Oh boy. Uh, you are gonna be so fucking sorry! Go away! I thought I grabbed the key. I don't know. Nope. Help! Somebody, please! You 
stupid bitch! That's a dead end! It's gonna be! Oh god. Oh god. Oh my god. myself. Thank you, Play Isaac, for the 444 bits. That was great. Oh, son of a bitch. Please. This is your last fucking chance. No! No, stop. Hi, I got your key. Hello. Hi. <laughs> See you later, nerd. <laughs> Shut up, old man. You smell like fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Thank you so much, play that. Oh no! Sneak! Squeeze! 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 Oh god. Shit. Shit! Thank you again, Blind Isaac, for the 444 bits. I think I didn't thank both of them, so thank you. Oh my god. for the 777 bits and play nice thing for the 300 bits both dragon quarter votes thank you <laughs> 30 minutes earlier good to see you again claire we've got unfinished business what are you talking about don't waste my fucking time bring me the pendant or sherry dies the pendant what do you need it for you want the girl to die? Fine. Where are you? The orphanage. The orphanage? Where is that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Is Sherry all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. 
Are you serious? Damn it! Just you wait, asshole. Oh my god, he's still walking around. They didn't, they, they, oh my freaking god. They didn't, they didn't reset anything. It's just straight up, he's still following you. Oh, okay, okay, we can go through the office though. Don't be in here, 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 don't be in here. Okay, the dongle though. Shit, the dongle. I'm not leaving the PlayStation until I use that dongle. Armory's all the way over there though. Frick. Totally forgot about the dongle. I, there's no way I'm leaving that. There's, there's no way I'm leaving that behind. Oops. I have to go for it. Uh, okay, well, we're saving it. Inspector Gadget is trying to do his job. <laughs> oh my god. All right, roof. Down the balcony. Yeah, roof. We're, I'm just gonna book it. We're just gonna have to run. If we see him, we run. House is haunted. Play another game. <laughs> House has definitely got a couple spooks going on in here. Oh no. I think I want to go through the library. Library. Down through the lounge. Okay, let's go. Rarg? Oh, it's just you. His name is Starvin' Marvin now. Mystic Quest 11. <clears throat> Letters, stars, members. To my bestest stars, buds. How y'all doing in that drab old station hanging in there against old irons? Me, I just got back from a date with a hot chick. But bet you can guess what we are up to under the extra large, her extra large umbrella. That's too many Mystic Quests. <laughs> Europe is amazing. One month. One month, one month is in no way enough to even scratch the surface. Maybe you'll extend my vacation for another six months. Barry, don't even think of coming to join me. Wouldn't want to make all the cute girls cry. Yeah, so just leave the babes to me. <clears throat> Jill, if Claire tries to contact you, please let her know I'm okay. Chris Redfield, August 29th. This does not sound like Chris. Yeah, what? That totally sounds like Chris. I would know. I've played as him in other Resident Evil games. You're just a stupid sister. 